Hello, BookTube. I just finished reading Secret by Yoshiki Tanagi. It's a three-part manga series, and I just wanted to share my thoughts on it with you. Secret is not my first encounter with the mangaka Yoshiki Tanagi. I previously read Doubt, which was a four-part series, and I did a review on my channel. I've tried to copy a link down below, but for some reason it wasn't letting me do it, or the link wasn't functional. So just go to my channel, I'll check under playlist, and you'll see Doubt manga review listed there. Uh, he also did Judge, which was a six-part series. I didn't do a formal review on it. I might have talked about it on my channel, but I enjoyed both of those very much. Doubt um, was about a video, uh, sorry, a cell phone game called Rabbit Doubt that students were playing um, kind of anonymously, and then they kind of come to learn that they're all living sort of in the same area and decide to meet in person. And something happens shortly after where they all um, are knocked unconscious and wake up in this warehouse uh, for swearing these kind of rabbit heads, uh, only to find out they are now living a um, a real life version of the rabbit doubt game, which is where there's amongst all the rabbits, there's a wolf, a killer amongst their midst. So somebody locked up in the warehouse with them, one of their own or someone else, they don't know yet, is a wolf, uh, a killer. And it was a really fascinating, uh, gripping uh, manga. I really loved it. Judges equally uh, kind of along the same lines, uh, kind of locked locked room mystery. Think along the lines of Saw. People suddenly wake up in this weird situation. How are you going to get out of it? If they have to turn on each other. And Judge uh, dealt with the uh, students all being guilty of the various seven deadly sins, and they'd have to kind of offer up one, each one of them um, so of the group. Someone would have to be offered up within a certain period of time, or something bad would happen. Um, I won't get all the detail into that, but I really enjoyed both of those mangas. So I came across Secret. This is literally just a really short one, a three-part one. Um... And again, you have the rabbit heads. It seems to be a theme within this uh, mangaka's drawings. And there's a, one scene where there, there's somebody actually um, wearing... Um, let me see if I can not give away anything. Uh, there's somebody wearing this rabbit um, head. Let me see a little peek right there. Okay, but anyway. Um, what happens with this one is we have um, a bus accident has occurred... Uh, kind of prior to the start of this series. And these are the six survivors of this bus accident from their class. I think some 36 students or so, uh, including a teacher and the bus driver, were all killed. And they are uh, seeing a counselor named Mitomo. And immediately uh, he accuses um, them of like three murderers are hiding in your midst. Of these six students, there are three murderers. Uh, they're hiding secrets. And uh, the only way... Uh, well, he wants in the anguish of their crimes, basically, and find a way to answer for them within a week, or he's going to offer up his evidence to the police. Um, so you can imagine, out of six students, apparently three of them are murderers. Uh, it was really quite shocking, and I love the way the story kind of unfolds. Although it starts out almost too fast, where it's like, boom, this has already happened, and boom, you know, two pages in, you're like, they're, they're already... Uh, fighting with this counter who's like making this accusation and stuff. And then this first volume kind of slows down a bit as you kind of come to learn a little bit more about the characters, who they are, uh, some of the events of um, the accident and things that took place during the accident or leading up to the accident, uh, what various characters' relationships are to each other. So it was a bit of a, a bit slow in the first one as it starts to unfold. Um, trying not to uh, flash by anything that might give away something here. Uh, but uh, I, I like the pacing uh, as it started to pick up towards the end of it and left me on a bit of a cliffhanger. Diving into volume two, two was really, really great. Started to um, just really um, throw a bunch of things into the loop. Like the beginning of these show people sitting in these rabbit hats. But um, yeah, volume two took off really well. Uh, lots of good um, revelations about characters and surprises that you're kind of coming to learn uh, that almost all of these students have some sort of secret, uh, whether it's involved with the accident or prior to the accident. Uh, and it just culminated in a really great finale. Uh, so I think I gave like three stars to this and then um, like four stars for the, the remaining two. But I really enjoyed it. I really enjoy his artwork. Uh, and just uh, I love the kind of idea of this sort of like locked room type situation. Although in this case they are free to roam about. Uh, it does feel like they are sort of trapped um, within their secrets here and, and the situation. Uh, if you want to give this uh, a particular manga a try, I would say definitely start with Doubt. Doubt was my favorite. 
A judge was equally good. And then if you just want something quick, um, doubt or secret are both good ones to start with. So I hope you guys enjoyed this kind of quick review. Uh, I just wanted to throw this together and share my thoughts on it. If you guys have read it before or if you read anything by uh, Yoshiki Tanagi, let me know down below what you thought about them. Hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.